Well, and I'd like to add one thing, you know, that we've got to move on. But I know Gary, me, Virginia, I don't know how many, Kevin, you were born and raised here too, right? And Don, okay. I can go by a, a lot of fields that used to be farmland, it's now got houses on them. And my question to the district is, what happened to those border use permits? Are we getting credit back for, you know, if, if that, if that, Subdivision now has a, uh, especially around Newberry, there was there's a lot of farms that were bad that's now in houses. That water, you know, ag still ag they yeah, issued they, the permit for ag. Ag's not using it. People are for right. residential homes. So yeah, it's a multi-house. It is. Problem. It it's really not is. just that. It's that. Yeah. But I agree. To me, what I was hearing was. When it comes to like this particular case, that's why I asked the question: What happened? What changed? Why all of a sudden did they need a big water drop? I think every time this happens and comes before the board, that question needs to be asked and say, "Okay, what's changed? What's going on? What's happening there?" Um, because if they've been ag working this thing, and then all of a sudden, oh, we need two new 16-inch wells or something, we want to put pivot arms in. Well, we see more pivot arms. Right. This area right in here, when I was younger, you could leave the red light in Newberry and go to Archer, and there was nothing but farmland out there. Take that road today. A lot of the land that was being used for farm has houses on it, so farming is having to be moved to someplace else. And that's why you've got to have these new farms. One of the things on that subject that I found um, is You'll take a family farm, no longer about foot, just a family farm. And you'll, like you said, all of a sudden, hey, this house is Well, that's because they, they realized there was more money in the land selling it to developers. And so they stopped farming and they moved somewhere else to farm, or they got out of farming because they got old and the family didn't want to keep farming. And so, yeah, this is, there's an evolution going on of all this stuff. You have to recognize. But to just automatically say it's not happening, it's happening. You can kind of see it. And if you start documenting it and start really looking at all this stuff, you know, it's there and it's all a giant problem. And that's a lot I think, you know, everybody is talking about is we're pulling all this water and sooner or later we're going to end up eating like California or something like that, where they're in desperation. And it's devastating industry, it's devastating people, lifestyles, the cost of everything is going up. Uh, yeah, I think this can't I moved in that here to get away from all the Thank you.